I was born in Range, Utah, about 2.15 a.m. in the morning of September the 24th, 1934, and there's no astrological way you can chart me. But a lot of people say, what sign were you born under? I say, Abe Michigan's Delicatessen. When I was young, they penned out a piece of paper, and I thought, oh, an IQ test. Well, that's OK. I got a good IQ. I can pass this thing. The man said, if you could have one thing, one, only one, what would you want? I wrote on the paper, I would like my mind to leave me alone. I was in an auto accident in 1963. I was in and out of a coma state. After waking up, I'd been aware of some changes made inside of me. They call it a near-death experience, but it turned out to be a new life experience. I was told when I was out of the body, the reason you're here is because you're a rebellious spirit. Well, that was true. And now you're going to receive this mantle of the sound current and the light, and it's going to be called the mystical traveler. The first time I saw him, I said, you're nothing like what I expected. And he said, well, were you expecting like Jesus Christ or someone like that? And I said, well, yeah. And he said, you must have been disappointed. I worked through inspiration. And under these lights, I worked through perspiration. It just spread as people agreed to host six seminars a week in six different locations. It got bigger and bigger and bigger. The spirit has brought us all together. Movement of spiritual inner awareness. If I stumble, the primary thing that's going to happen to us is we're going to be attacked. I'm not a guru. If I fall, don't fall in the same hole. Watch where I step so you can step around it. Friends have asked me if I thought he was a con man. Either love me or hate me, but indifference, it kills me. I think he's just a really wonderful person who cares about people and who has helped lives. John Rogers is a good soul. The philosophy is quite simple. Love God, love yourself, take care of yourself so you can take care of people around you, and don't hurt yourself and don't hurt others. <laughs>